So the China-Australia Free Trade Agreement and the Trans-Pacific Partnership Free Trade Agreement are basic agreements between countries designed to lower um, trade barriers in terms of you know, exports between particular countries. So for example, with the China-Australia Free Trade Agreement, that's from an Australian perspective, is designed to allow Australian businesses um, um, export their goods into China or export their services in China by lowering tariffs. Similarly, the TPP uh, Free Trade Agreement um, is designed to allow Australia to export goods and services to a basket of countries um, ranging from you know, the US, um, New Zealand, um, Malaysia, Singapore, um, those type of countries in the Asian Pacific region, again with lower cost entry in terms of lower tariffs. In terms of the voice survey, what we found surprising was that um, the majority of participants in the survey were aware of the China-Australia Free Trade Agreement. So over 64% of those surveyed were aware of that agreement. However, only 40% were aware of the Trans-Pacific Partnership Free Trade Agreement. So what we also found interesting was that of those participants that were surveyed who were aware of those agreements, only 15% were taking advantage um, of those particular agreements. Despite being in the digital age and the prevalence of e-commerce in today's businesses, what we found interesting with the voice survey was approximately 60% of our respondents found that physical distance was one of the main challenges in terms of operating overseas. And this um, was more of a challenge than in terms of cultural differences or language barriers.